This is mockernut hickory and pignut hickory. Mockernut and pignut. And what I'm going to do is kind of, you can actually like make a little two columns actually with an end and a P. So I'm going to give you the, I'm going to give you like counts and differences. Okay, so leaf. You could like, like let, write leaf over in the left variable is leaf. This has mocker seven leaflets. So put seven. Pignut fives. And again, these are mostly. You know, they can be seven to nine or five to seven. Mostly. Mocker nut rachis. What's the rachis? The leaf stem. Okay. Is fuzzy. And the species, Caryatomentosa, tomentos means fuzzy woolly. Okay? Pignut, the rachis, the leaf stem, this thing. There's five leaflets, by the way. This is the rachis. This is the petiole, but this whole leafy stem thing. This is glabrous. Glabrous means waxy smooth. The species is Caria glabra. So Caria glabra is glabrous. Twig, mocker nut, the twig is tomentose. It's fuzzy. Caria glabra, guess what it is? Glabrous. <laughs> the twig. Husks, what do you find in? Okay, mocker nut, thick. Now, not as thick as shag bark, so this would be second in thickness. That's pretty thick. Pig nut, they're kind of mixed here. Anybody find a thin one? There's one. If we went up closer there, you'd find thin ones. Pig nut. Thin, not as thin as which one? Bitter, but that's pretty thin, huh? So when you're out in the woods, you have a big hickory tree, you look on the ground, you pull this up, it's thick, it doesn't have shaggy bark, it's got to be mocking, because <coughs> it's thick. And then the bark, I don't know what kind of word to put in your table, because <laughs> again, bark, it's hard to describe. Very distinctly, uniformly woven. You see the perfect, it's like really open ash bark. But even on, it's better than that. The tops of the ridges are silvery gray. More like red, uh, red oak, almost. Yeah, red oak is straight it's streaks. Suffers, yeah. yeah, this weaves like open fishnet. Ash is way denser than that and tighter. And then pig nut, um, <laughs> Very irregularly rough, thick ridges. That's basically it. Now you first again, you gotta go be back. Oh, it's compound, is it opposite or alternate? Okay, it's alternate. Oh, now the buds. You remember, if, if you look up and get your head right, the leaves are up there, so they're kind of messing us up. You can see really big buds. Remember the picture I drew? It's like a Hershey kiss out on the end. It's gonna be easier when the leaves fall off but click through the photos. And then pig nut is a very slender, glabrous twig and smaller bud. Pig nut, a lot of the fruits in the woods are gonna be shaped like this. Okay, like a pear. This happens to be called an oval pig nut which isn't a species, it's just sometimes the fruits are oval and sometimes they're this shape, which gives it the name. And here's how you get that. If you turn it this way. You get a pig's head. Uh -huh. A little snow. So that's how that makes it.